Hey, this is Meredith Lego, and my whole YouTube uh, channel is all about Ascension Science and the mechanics behind expanding your consciousness. And um, a lot of my content focuses on helping you understand the quantum field in terms of how I've learned about it from extra dimensional beings who I've been able to channel, um, you know, from, from that all the way to um, essentially uh, you know, things that you can do to achieve your best and possible life by connecting with your higher self um, in future times. So um, with, with that, in this particular video, I'm going to share a cryptic message that really doesn't have anything to do with Ascension. And I was, you know, debating whether or not to share it. Um, but hey, why not? It, it's kind of interesting. We'll see if it ever plays out. But it was uh, somewhat of a cryptic message that I got about whistleblowing <laughs> that's going to be taking place in the future. So in this particular case, I was meditating early, early in the morning, and I all of a sudden heard a reporter is whistleblowing soon on DNA texting. So a whistleblower is reporting soon on DNA texting, the sending of DNA to beings. <laughs> So um, I found that interesting because obviously I've been receiving a lot of um, material or I've been downloading or connecting with other beings on a lot of material about um, how our physical bodies um, can change with codes that we tend to download and how that starts to upgrade or alter aspects of our DNA. And that is very much an organic form, especially um, when it can be coming from the sun. So here I've got this message coming in saying that there's this thing called DNA texting and that it was about sending DNA to beings. It almost sounds like it's coming in through a fax or something like that or through Wi-Fi. Um, now, I'll tell you that I did try and do some research on this. Um, I didn't find anything about um, transmissions of DNA. Um, I know that certainly can happen through the sun or through photons but through intentional forms other than that, I'm obviously not aware of that. And if it was something that was meant to be whistleblown, that means it's probably something that's veiled and not very known right now, or at least not widely accessible on the internet. The only thing that I found about DNA texting is that, um, you know, obviously the DNA is a molecule, um, you know, within our physical construct that carries genetic information for the development and functioning of the organism. Um, but DNA texting is referred to um, the genome um, or a fragment of a genome. Um, so, and I'm just reading some material that I, I researched about it. So a DNA text um, is an array of symbols um, designating DNA basic elements and nucleotides. Um, the symbols arranged in a group provide definite and recognizable instructions. And another way to think about it is that um, the DNA text, essentially, when you see it sort of written in um, different scientific materials or whatever, um, speaks to different alphabetic letters that go in different sequences, se sequences and it's A, C, G, T, and I think that references um, Shoot, I didn't. I didn't type this down, but I think it references the um, the 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 kind of construct of what DNA is made of. <laughs> so, um, but A C G T, and um, unfortunately, I I don't have it written down. Um, my kids probably could tell me because they just learned it in science. But but essentially, that's what DNA texting is is kind of the the writing down or the sequences of those codes, if you will and how they essentially then make up um, different patterns. I think that the being um, or whoever I was receiving this information from was implying um, that it has nothing to do with how we're kind of writing down the sequencing of the DNA. It had to do more with the fact that there seems to be some sort of technology where DNA is actually being texted or sent <laughs> to beings. <laughs> so. Who knows? Time will tell. I certainly couldn't find anything about it, but hey, if you guys happen to know, anybody uh, seeing this would love for any insights that you have um, that you could share in the comments. So with that, have a great rest of your day and I'll see you in future videos. Thanks. Bye.